those vapes Keep your wicks wet And your coils tight If you're looking for new flavors And all about the clouds We're all filling up a clear road We're dripping on the sub On reviews for the juice While Trav and Josh host View it on YouTube And prepare for overdose We're over those vapes Yep Josh, Travis Brand new eyeballs If you don't know what we do Is we review uh, Vape juice Vape hardware Vape liquid Whatever you want to call it And, and you know Vapors extravaganza Plus the mods And the and the tanks And the drippers And the, the do wikis And the what words The wit words And the who's it's uh, And we do it on a Zero to five scale Damn. Today We are looking at Something like Josh said From Modus Vapors This one is Pablo Pink And Pablo. it is Their pink lemonade With a tropical twist To take the edge Off the summer swelter Swelter dog Boom son yeah, boy. So you know what we're working with now. Now you know what the fuck we're doing. So uh, that's what we're going to be looking at today. Uh, let's jump up close. Look at these great bottles. Yep, these are from Drip Club. Uh, they decided to make their own juice. They got a line named Modus, and uh, this one, the flavors. Yeah, thanks to Drip Club for sending this out. Um, yeah. If you guys don't know who Drip Club, Drip Club is, uh, they're, a, they're like a digital storefront now, an online storefront. You can go check it out. They have a ton of variety, so... And the artwork does not get much better than this, dude. This it's, bottle and these boxes are so sick. Check them out. Pablo and specifically is, yeah. is dope. Mexican wrestler on there, bro. Yeah, probably named Pablo Lucha Libre. It's just what I'm thinking. Uh, I had to bust out the old IPV3. Damn, you sure did. Because I want to go high wattage on this. Um, he ain't fucking around right now, dude. I ain't get fucking around. Get stuck in the ground. <laughs> got some of that Yeti's vapes. Yeah, I got some Yeti's coil. Uh, Yeti uh, Uncle Yeti sent me some coils. Go Yeti. to www uh, Yeti Yeti vapes dot. Some shit. You'll uh, see it below. I'll put it up right now. Yeah, you'll see it. Oh, no. www.yetivapes.vapeshack.org Vapeshack, bro. Um, so, I got some, uh, what do they call them? Staggered Fuse Claptons? Some, right. some shits. Josh is supposed to know. Some bird's nest, bro. Oh, you, you do know. No, you don't. From the cool master. Yeah, uh, yeah, but uh, these were sent to us by Yeti. He's an awesome motherfucker. But in order to power these, I needed some wattage. So some wattage. I got this bad boy up to 139 watts, five Damn. volts. Let's rock it out. Let's go then. Hmm. So I do want to mention, out of the bottle, shit smells weird. It smells weird, yeah fucking weird it smells really true like you can smell like i don't know if they're using like guava or passion fruit or one of those uh tropical tropical fruits but you can definitely get a really strong odor of that it smells like it clashes big time it, does. it doesn't vape like that necessarily but the smell out of the bottle is crazy the smell vaped is, is a little bit more subdued yeah um but you still get that, that it's still smell. sharp it's a little like almost like a flowery yeah. You know what I mean? Like yeah. a little flowery. Like it's hardcore off the bottle. Flower. I mean, this shit was completely uh, vacuum sealed and wrapping and everything, and you could still fucking... Woo! It's pungent. It's pungent. Exactly. Yeah. So, the vape, though. Um, the lemon is definitely taking a backseat to the tropical fruits. Um, I'm not... Like I said, I don't know yeah. exactly what tropical fruits, but to me, I'm tasting things like the guava... Papaya. The, the papaya... Yeah. Things yep. like that, of that nature. Those you know are it, I mean? yeah. Uh, maybe mango, something like that. Uh, but there's a mix of them for sure, and they are the prevalent flavor. Yeah, they are. Uh, the lemon is definitely a backseat, so it's like a fucking guava papaya lemonade. Right? Yes. But those, yes. those two first, it's more tropical than it is just lemon, which a lot of you will like. It is good. Like, I mean, it's, it's good. It's, 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 not, it's not pungent like it is the smell. Um, nothing sticking out too much. The, for tropical flavors, they actually do pretty well together. I was, ex you know, I was expecting, and I want, 
more tart pink lemonade with a backing. Right. The way it's listed, the way that the way that it's advertised, they they advertise it with a pink lemonade with a tropical twist. Yeah. I want the pink lemonade. I'm just not getting enough of it. Yeah. I mean, maybe it's just me, but I don't think so. I think that the the main stars are maybe not even on purpose, but these flavors, these tropical flavors, they tend to overtake other flavors, even even flavors as strong as pink lemonade. Uh, I do enjoy the seventy thirty. I got no problem with the cloudage, the long fill. I mean, it's a nice vape. It's totally a nice vape. Holds up the heat well. Um, I got it on the Heracles RDA here. Like I said, with the Yeti um, uh, fused, spaced, Looking notch, crazy fucking bird's coils. Nest, bro. Some bird's nest. Yep. Um, oming out to point two. Yeah, uh, not being a crazy tropical dude, I'm going to go three. Um, and, and it is missing that pink and that lemonade isn't as bright as I thought it was. I'm gonna, yeah, I agree totally, 100%. I think that it's not a pink lemonade vape. It is a tropical fruit vape. Um, that being said, if you like tropical fruits, this is a really good example of that. Mm-hmm. Um, the lung fill is great. The vape itself is really good. Um, yeah. But it is, it's not tart. It's more sweet than anything else. Yeah. Um, you gotta like them tropical. That, you know, if guava and papaya, you go ding, 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 then it's, you're gonna like it. Yeah. Because um, they're pretty bright. They're really bright, and they're, mm-hmm. they're like, you know, they're the number one flavors. So, and they, t- they taste real, and they're crisp, yeah. and they don't, like, stick. There's no sucrose or, like, weird sweetness. They're good. I mean, they're fresh, you know. They do taste fresh. Yeah. They do taste like actual fruit, fruit and not, you know, uh, candy, and they don't taste, like, artificial, per right. se, you know right. what I mean? And there's and no, no... It's not gross. Or it's anything. not gross, and there's no, like, sweeteners or, like, weird earth flavors and shit yeah. in there. Um, but it's missing a pretty big element that I was excited about. So I'm going to say 3-2, uh, yeah. not, not 32, but 3, three. also. Sure. Because um, it's it could have been a 4 easily if they would have just ramped up that lemon. Uh, but as it stands right now, it's more of a tropical fruit vape. And yeah. um, while, while it's a good one of those, it's not exactly what they advertise. So 3 is what it is. Yeah. That's 0 to 5 scale. That still means it's highly vapeable. It's still a good vape. Just not something that I would run out and buy. We've, we've both just kind of, we've had issues with those, you know, papaya, guava, kind of those dirty fruits, kind of, you know. We refer to them as dirty fruits. Yeah, dirty dogs. <laughs> cool, man. Thanks for watching. Thank Drip you. Drip Club. Thank yeah, you so totally. much, man. Absolutely. Yeah. Drip Club. Uh, we appreciate the chance to check out this line that everybody's talking about. The Modus line is everywhere. I mean, I see it on Instagram and Twitter. It's big right now. It's big right now, so we're happy to be able to get a chance to take a look at it. Perfect timing, Drip Club. Absolutely. Love it. Yep. And yep. thank you guys. You guys are the most important. The people who watch. Straight um, up. You know, Josh's, Josh's uh, fan club. You know, they're here to watch my fan club. We're still waiting. All right? (laughs) So please, keep your clothes tight. Keep them fucking wicks wet.